You ain't gonna fry your little meat hooks. Just pick it up. Let's go, Star Pants. Bring it over. Here you go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing puts out. So, uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Rocket! Help me scramble some critters! No, no, no Scott! If I don't rewire this fast, it's gonna go short! Fucking monster things! Everyone get ready! Keep him away from that missile, Groot! If that thing was gonna blow, it happened already! Just keep these things away from me! Careful, Rocket! Some of these things are better than you! Easy for you to say! You've got a pointy stick! Oh, crap! Thanks for the heads up, bud! to see you fix it next time. Come on, two down, two to go. I don't see any way out of the missile bay except that passage, bud. Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? If the two of us gotta lug that monster- Guys, this job is a huge deal. It's for the freaking monster queen of Seknarf 9. She just doesn't know it yet. Man, that thing is ridiculous. I think it was a ship or a robot. That's a Cree Sentry, a robot, but it would have been space worthy. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. Impressive, but I can fly circles around something that big. Give me a fast and sexy M-Class scout over those things any day. I do appreciate that sweet Ravager pirate tech. She's made for hidden runs. <laughs> and boy, can she run. She can hit, too. There's always room for more firepower, Quill. That sentry probably took on whole fleets. This old Kree tech gets me wondering. Where would I be now if those blue butt scots managed to keep me locked into their half world experiments? <laughs> yeah, chances are you'd be climbing over bits of me right now. I wasn't even a person to the worst of the Kree's mad scientists. More like a real smart walking gun. A very talkative gun. <laughs> yeah, that part was an accident. They tried to fix it a few times. I am the entire facility was the problem. I wish I'd gone back and blown it up before the end of the war. Man, that thing is ridiculous. I think it was a ship or a robot. That's a Cree Sentry, a robot, but it would have been space worthy. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. 
They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. How do you know all this? Because they were my fellow experiments back on Half-World. Most of my parts came from the cybernetics hangar next to the door, so, uh... I got a sneak peek at all the new killbots. I can see the parts come and go from my, uh... Uh, my cage. I didn't mean to open old wounds. Eh, eh, most of them are just scars now anyways. I wasn't even a person for the worst of the Kree's mad scientists. More like a real smart walking gun. A very talkative gun. <laughs> yeah, that part was an accident. They tried to fix it a few times. I am Groot. The entire facility was the problem. I wish I'd gone back and blown it up before the end of the war. Of course there ain't any plants here. I can hear your visor working. Better not be cheating on our bet, Quill. How can you hear that? Peter Quill, the double agent is trying to lull me into a false sense of security. Right. And the moment you drop your guard, I'll strike. Aha! So you admit it! You got me. My plans are foiled. Groot, need you to shoot a bridge right into that eye socket. Now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Wait, is that... Yes! I'm about to win this bet, Quill! Here goes nothing. <laughs> We're inside a giant robot head. And I got robot parts inside my head. You have robot parts inside your head. Bam! <laughs> hey, Groot, what do you think I should do with the units I'm about to win off Quill? I mean when he gets money and then gives it to me, since I'm winning! Found a nest! Maybe this is the Parasite Clubhouse! I'm having the time of my life! Quill! Shoot down a nest if you're having fun. Speaks for itself. <laughs> exactly. You suck, Star God. <laughs> Let's see. When I beat Quill, I'm gonna get my hands on some rotating hyper circuits. Boo! No one knows what those are. You're not happy. I take no orders from you. Uh, you know what, Quill? I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points should count double from now on. That's cheating. All right, bumper goes there, Quill. gonna install itself. I'm not... It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. I only flipped the switch on and off to see if it started. Gotta love that kill radius. <laughs> At least they make a good flat. It is indeed, sir. Don't feel bad, buddy. They started it. Missing all the fun last time. Don't forget about that bumper. Real funny, Quill. 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 <laughs> <laughs> 